The El Paso County Sheriff's Office says human remains found in Florida they believe belong to Gannon Stock. He is the 11 year old boy who has been missing from Colorado Springs since late January. That news is not unexpected, still difficult to digest. The El Paso County Sheriff's Office says it was deputies in Santa Rosa County that found the body in Pace, Florida two days ago. Pace is near Pensacola. That's the Florida Panhandle. It's some 1500 miles away from Colorado Springs. El Paso County investigators say the remains have been tentatively identified as Gannon via autopsy. We just heard from the DA's office about all of this. And our Lori Lizarraga now has the latest. That's right. The DA's office addressed the media not an hour ago. What we heard from the prosecutor in this case against Gannon's stepmom are serious new allegations that charge her with murder in the first degree with intent and deliberation. Today I filed new formal charges in the case against Leticia Stout. Those charges are murder in the first degree after deliberation, a class one felony that carries a potential prison sentence of life in prison without parole. In addition to that, the prosecutor also said he's filed eight counts of criminal violence against Leticia Stauk, alleging the use of a firearm, the use of a blunt instrument, the use of a knife or other sharp object, and causing the death of Gannon Stauk. Investigators are not discussing his manner of death or the circumstances of how he was found in Florida just yet, as the investigation is still ongoing. Gannon disappeared on January 27th from his home in Lorson Branch. Letitia Stauk was arrested in Myrtle Beach, South Carolina on March 2nd, five weeks after she first reported her stepson a runaway to authorities. And today, a reporter asked Prosecutor Michael Allen if he believed Gannon Stauk was killed in Colorado. Allen said the El Paso County Sheriff's Office would not be able to charge this case if it didn't happen in their jurisdiction. So these charges allege that Stauk killed Gannon here in Colorado and was taken some 1,400 miles to pace Florida. Now Stuck is due back in court on April 14th and El Paso County Sheriff's Office is asking people if they saw or believe they could have seen Letitia Stuck in Pace or Pensacola, Florida between February 3rd and February 5th, that they please call El Paso County Sheriff's Office tip line. That number on the screen 719-520-6666. There's also an email that you can send your tips to, but of course they're very adamant about that time frame, February 3rd to February 5th, either in Pace or Pensacola, Florida. So hopefully we can get that news out there in case anyone did see anything. Kim, Tom? Well, there are some answers coming, it seems like, as far as what happened, but your heart turns to that 11-year-old boy and uh, your mind turns back to his birth mother and father at that press conference on the day they filed those yes. charges uh, uh. the first time. And, uh, the emotional impact of such a loss. Uh, Lori will continue to follow the story. Thanks. Absolutely.